Hi guys and welcome to TechBase. In this video, we're going to talk about the best AI presentation maker in 2025. Have you ever wondered if AI can create a PowerPoint presentation for you? Well, yes, it can. And in this video, I'm going to show you a very nice platform that can help you do that. And it is an online platform, which is called WorkPPT. And this platform requires no installation and it has full cross device compatibility, unlike traditional tools such as PowerPoint or Google Slides. With basically one click, you can create an AI powered presentation and you're going to have access to advanced customization, integrated AI tools, and also PDF features inside this single platform, which is called WorkPPT. So let's just start using it. The platform is looking very simple, minimalistic, and intuitive. You basically have the main functions in the left side, and here you have the main interface. We're going to begin with AI slide, which is basically the whole highlight of this platform. And here you can either type a prompt for this platform or AI to create a presentation, or you can even add a file, for example, a text document, docx, or PDF document, and the AI will create a PowerPoint presentation based off of that file. One other thing that I like about this is that you can type in any language, basically, and I'm going to select from here one to 10 cards, basically the slides. And here, let's just type in a simple prompt that is also in line with our channel. For example, make me a presentation about Windows 11 25 H2. And then you can click on this button and it's going to start generating some ideas for this presentation and then we can click on generate my presentation. Once you click on that, you're going to have to choose a template to complete your AI creation. And for example, we're going to go into the technology section. And from here, let's select, for example, this one, and then just click on the plus button in order to start the creation of the PowerPoint presentation. And as you can see, the AI is creating a PowerPoint presentation for us with bullet points, with illustrations, and with other visual additions. I think that is a pretty interesting thing that you can do with AI. As you can see, let's just go pretty fast over these overview and features of Windows 11 24 H2. And you can see here some of the key features of Windows 11 25 H2 alongside with other information and other useful things that will be added in Windows 11 25 H2. So I think this is a really nice way of creating a PowerPoint presentation using AI. I was thinking about this and if I had this back when I was in school, it would have been very useful. But of course, kids nowadays will have access to these tools and of course, will be able to create things like this. And of course, it's not only for kids, it can be easily used for business reports, teaching, academic presentations, startup pitches, and more. And one good thing is that you also have a free version available. Now from the right side, you also have some customization options. For example, you can insert a text, you can insert a shape, you can insert a line, a chart, a table, insert a video or audio if you want, insert a logo or insert an image. I think this is pretty useful. And of course, you can edit this. For example, here, as you can see, there's a small problem. It didn't add this point after one. We can edit and we can customize text in detail with the font, the size, the style, and the paragraph spacing, word spacing, and even more symbols, positions, animations. You can also add animations if you want. For example, I want to add an animation for this element, the bounce and animation. I think that is pretty interesting. Now, of course, you can save the changes that you're doing. Then you can also change up the design if you want. You have here a lot of options or for example, transitions. You can add a fade in or slide left or right transition. And then you can click on apply to all. I think that is also a useful thing. And then you can, of course, download this and you can export it as an PPTX image or even print or export as a PDF. So I think that is also pretty nice. We can export it at PPTX and then are going to be able to save it on your computer. Going back to the main interface of this platform, I'm also going to insert here a PDF document, basically an article again about Windows 11. And we're going to see what it can do with a prompt like this, a file basically. And I'm going to insert here one to 10 cards and I'm going to click on generate my presentation. Let me also show you the original file. This is the original PDF document. It is something about Windows 11 25 H2, some information. And then we're going to click on generate my presentation. Yet again, we're going to click on technology and select another template, for example, this one. Then we're going to click on the plus button to create this new presentation. As you can see, it is pretty interesting how it creates it, how fast it creates it, and it will create it only with information that is either directly or derived from that PDF document that we've inserted into this platform. As you can see, it is pretty nicely implemented and created. You can see all the information that was available in that that PDF document and I think it created such a nice presentation that can be used wherever you want. And of course, don't forget about the customization tools. You can even replace the template if you want and it's going to keep the information, but just replace the template. So I think that is pretty useful. And of course, as I've said, it has a strong cross-platform compatibility and also easy sharing. Just click on the share button. You can easily share to a social media platform or just copy the link and use it wherever you want. In this case of this presentation, let's quickly just change a few things. For example, let's just change the font. 
let's use some opacity here and also a shadow behind the text and also a blur distance let's change up the text color a bit let's make it a bit more dark you can also enable a border in the texture if you want and of course you can apply predefined custom presets if you want for example this one that you can add to the powerpoint presentation going back to the main interface of the platform we're going to be able to use other ai functions for example ai chat and you can use this basically as you're using any ai chat for example tell me something about windows 11 and it's going to generate a chat like any other ai chat i think this is also something pretty useful as you can see it successfully generates information also we have ai pdf and we can use these options to merge pdfs split pdf and more other things or edit functions for pdfs we have ai summarizer and here you can just upload a file for example i'm just going to upload the same pdf file that i've uploaded into ai slide and we're just going to do a quick summary about that it's going to quickly do it as you can see it is successfully creating a summary of that pdf document so this is basically work ppt as i've said fast professional and beginner friendly you have a lot of templates where you can choose from it supports a lot of languages i even tried my language and it successfully creates presentation very well and of course you have a lot of useful things you can use it for whatever you want and you have multiple ai features into one single platform and of course if you want to try it out for yourself make sure to check out the description below they're going to have more information about work ppt and you can try it out for yourself even the free version to see what it can do and how it can help you in your day-to-day -day life if you need to create a presentation so this was the video for today i hope you liked it if you did please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one i was your man from tech base until next time have a nice day